Birdie's V-Trigger 2 is birdie time. Birdie gets a couple new special moves centered around his chain. The install is very slow. Not only can Birdie not use it to combo on the ground, it's actually very punishable even on hit. So the best way to install is from afar, or from confirmed attacks that knock down. You can install during the same special moves as VT1, but hitting with the flame is much more specific. The only juggles I can find are Cornered Crouch Fierce, or Cornered Normal or EX Zonk. Either Zonk into VT2 juggles into Crouch Fierce, which is cool. While active, Birdie's Chain and Jumping Grab special moves do slightly more damage, though they don't appear to come out faster or have new follow-ups. Hitting Fierce and Roundhouse together gives you a chain attack. It can be done anytime Birdie is capable of activating Trigger, which means you can actually do it from Zonk and Bullhead in addition to most of his normals. It pulls the opponent in, and it's only minus 2 on block, so it's generally safe. It's not juggle friendly at all. And you can only combo if you cancel into it from Heavies or EX Bullhead. But it's not too bad to do raw. If it hits, it leads to a free juggle state. Hitting down plus trigger input gives you a low chain. This is also minus two and gives you a huge range low. It's a little faster than high chain, and it combos from most mediums. You can actually juggle into the low chain from Bullhead. I didn't see any juggles out of it, but it does good damage and leaves the opponent point blank and knocked over, so I guess it's not a bad ender. It works with your V skill too. Hitting banana with low chain will move it. while hitting the cam with low chain gives you a bouncing projectile. Here are some sample combos. Regardless of which chain you use, they both use up one third of your remaining V time. Brady can cancel his bullheads or zonks into chain on block. For bullhead, it makes them safe on block. Medium and EX bullhead into high chain are actually true block strings, as well as any bullhead into low chain. While the light and heavy bullheads give the opponent a 1 or 2 frame window to hit buttons, it's a good gimmick to catch mashing, but a pro will either respect it or even reverse a lot of it. Zonk into low chain trades with 3 frame normals and beats everything else. While EX Zonk into low chain gives the opponent 5 frames to interrupt so they can counter hit you with lights, it's still a mile better than having an EX Zonk fully blocked. Birdie's VT2 looks pretty interesting. There's some good neutral application with the ability to safely pull people in, not to mention being able to threaten with a long range low versus a damage improved Bull Revenger. The combo routes from EX Bullhead and the utility of making EX Zonk safer are both pretty cool. But the damage ups are for more situational moves than his VT1, which will probably last longer too, and VT1 has a much more useful install. From what I know, VT1 seems to be somewhat better. But I can see people picking Birdie VT2 for matchups or even just for preference. It lets you play a different kind of Birdie.